Hello friends, welcome to this new Java programming tutorial. Today we will discuss how to calculate compound interest through a Java program. So let's move to Eclipse and see how we can code a compound interest program. So friends, let's see how we can calculate compound interest in Java. So here we have created a class by the name compound interest demo and we have created a method which is main and whenever the, we execute the program this method will be called so let's code our program in this method so first in order to calculate compound interest we have to create a scanner which can take the user input so we will create a scanner object in order to use scanner we have to first import it now what this scanner does scanner it reads the user input from the console here we have created scanner by passing in system.in which is a stream which reads from the console where user can input the data so in order to calculate compound interest we need four variables let's create four variables we have created a variable by the name amount so what it will do it will hold the, the final result that is the compound interest for us we have created a double variable by the name principal which will hold our principal amount and we have created a double variable by the name rate which will hold the rate for which the com compound interest to be calculated and last we will create one more variable by the name so it holds the time period till which we will calculate the compound interest and now let's move ahead we will first prompt the user to enter these values we will ask him to enter the principal amount and we will capture the his inputs through scanners next double method and then we will prompt him to enter the rate and similarly we will capture his input by scanner.next double and similarly we will ask him to enter the time period after user has entered the, these three variables then we will calculate the compound interest based on the formula the formula would be that amount will be equal to the formula would be the amount will be compound interest will be equal to principal into 1 plus rate by 100 to the power time so let's move ahead and calculate the compound interest saying in order to calculate something to the power of something we can use math class math class is method it takes in two arguments so one argument will be 1 plus rate by 100 and whatever is going to be on the to the power it will be our second argument so we can calculate the compound interest as and our second argument will be time so after calculating the compound interest we will print it out on the console and when we run this program it will first ask us to enter the principal amount suppose we enter 1000 then it asks us to enter the rate suppose we enter 5% and then it asks us to enter the time and suppose we enter 10 years and when we hit enter so it calculates the compound interest as 1628.89 something so 
so friends th this was the way to calculate compound interest in java so what we did in this program we will just recap it once firstly we created a class by the name compound interest demo then we created a method which is main method every java program needs this method so that whatever you write inside it gets executed we then created a scanner object passing him in passing it in the system dot in which can allow the scanner to read from the console here we created four variables which were double by the by the name amount which hold the compound interest for us principal which hold the principal amount rate the rate through which the principal amount get increase and the time for how much years the for how much year we have to calculate the compound interest so initially we ask the user to enter the principal amount and we call the scanner dot next double method so whatever the user entered in the console it get picked up by the next double method and and the value is getting value assigned back to principal so we entered 1000 year and as soon as we hit enter this 1000 was read by the scanner and it was passed to the principal and similarly it was done with the rate and time so the formula for calculating the compound interest was it was it was like principal into 1 plus rate to the rate but divided by 100 to the power time so when we calculate compound interest by the formula principal into we use the we use the math dot power method which took the two arguments two double arguments one was one argument was something like 1 plus rate to the power 100 and the another argument was whatever you want to raise to the power so suppose if you want to calculate say x to the power n then x was our first argument and n was our second argument and after this line get executed the compound interest is calculated and assigned to amount and then we printed the compound interest on the console so friends that's all the video on calculating the compound interest in java so friends if you like this video then please like us on facebook and youtube share this video on facebook with your friends and if you have any comments to share then share it below you can also subscribe my video on youtube and you can also visit my blog at www.hubspot.com for more java tutorials and source code thank you very much have a nice day take care bye bye